In this video, I'm gonna talk about my experience working at Amazon, leaving, and then going right back after seven months. This is oftentimes referred to as a boomerang. It's when somebody leaves an employer and then goes right back. I'm gonna keep this video pretty raw and, and unedited. I just wanna talk through uh, why I left, why I went back, and what the rehire process looked like. So let's go ahead and get right into it. So first let's talk about why I left. Well, I spent a year at AWS as a senior solutions architect working with customers in the field. And while I had an awesome time, I, I would even describe it as the ideal first year at AWS. Uh, about a year in, a old peer and mentor of mine reached out asking me to come work with them at a startup uh, leading the pre-sales function. So for me, that was a cool opportunity. I thought I might get some leadership experience and I thought the space the startup was in, it was this customer data tool was really interesting. Uh, and of course I trusted this person that I'd worked with before. So I decided, hey, let's let's go for it. Uh, gave it a shot, had a lot of fun, spent about seven months at that startup. And while I enjoyed the time, uh, the customers I met were amazing. The people I worked with were amazing. It, it can be a, a challenging environment for startups right now in 2023, uh, at least from like a fundraising perspective. And so I think there was some risk and volatility that for me uh, made it difficult to stay stay uh, like mid to long term. And so uh, it I started to about five months and think about going back to Amazon for the stability and frankly for a work environment where I know I can thrive because I've, I've done it before and uh, I was successful there before. Once I had that realization, I reached out to an old friend of mine who I'd worked with at Amazon and even at a past company and asked if he could refer me to a role. Um, there were a lot of solutions architects roles open at the time. In fact, as my time of recording this, Amazon is hiring a bunch of solutions architects. So if you're a qualified pre-sales or consulting technical professional uh, and are interested in learning more, definitely reach out. But I got that referral from a friend of mine and a few days later, a recruiter reached out. Now, what the rehire process looked like was, was really ideal because I'd been gone for less than a year and I was going back to the exact same job family at the exact same seniority level. I didn't have to go through what they call the loop again. Now, this will be different for everybody to my understanding, and I'm not an authority on this. So if you're thinking about boomeranging back to Amazon, definitely pick your recruiter's brain on this particular subject. But for me, as I understand it, because I had only been gone for less than a year and I was going back to the same job family, same level, I didn't need to loop. I just needed to have a single conversation with the hiring manager. That said, I actually know people who have left for a year and then came back to the same job family and then were leveled up when they returned. So the point I really want to make is your experience may vary depending on how long you've been gone, the job family you're returning to. And I personally am not super informed on those policies, nor would I uh, likely discuss them publicly if I was, uh, but definitely use your recruiter as a source of truth there. So last thing uh, I'd like to talk about is just how I'm feeling after coming back. I've been back now for about four weeks and so far it, it's been an awesome decision, particularly because of the timing. I'm coming back at AWS and this whole AI thing is really uh, seriously cool and it's really fun to get hands on with that technology and start working with customers and creating content around that technology. So I'm pretty happy that I came back. It's also a job that I'm really comfortable in. And I think I'm at a phase in my life where um, while I always enjoy challenging myself, I, I, I like the idea of doing something that I know that I'm good at um, that doesn't necessarily require me to pull off heroics just to uh, perform at a baseline level. So um, there's a lot of comfort in, in that for me. And of course, the people at Amazon, I made so many amazing friends in the year I was there. These are some really exciting, passionate, intelligent human beings that it's just energizing to be able to work around. So that's it. That's kind of my story. I left, I came back. Um, if you're considering coming back and you're kind of conflicted about it, I understand. I, I was for a while too, because you know, it, it's a, it's a maybe not always a common decision to go back to a place that you left, especially if you left for a specific reasons. But if it's on your mind and you want to talk to somebody who's been through it, feel free to reach out. So good luck if you're looking to work at Amazon for the first time or return. I hope you get your dream job in that process. And until next time, take it easy. Bye.